Well, hi there, guys, and welcome to part three of Blue Fire. Um, I'm much more awake and much more alert this time, so hopefully this will go better. <laughs> um, I'm just listening to the music of this, and it, I'm, I, I suddenly realise what it reminds me of so much. And it actually reminds me of a, the first Pokemon movie, if you know, if you know what that, if you know what I mean. It reminds me of um, the piece of music where they're all crying. If I'm not going to spoil it if, for people who haven't seen it, but people who have seen it, you should know what I mean. And, but it also sounds a bit like Lugia's theme from another Pokemon movie. So it's just like a little thing that jumped into my head. But yes, okay, so let's see what happens, shall we? Oh god. <laughs> I'm already like, oh god. Alright, so this is where I left off and I was really confused about everything that was going on because I was half awake. But I, I remember, I looked back at it and I remember that I walked past uh, a thingy and, what is it? This way. I walked past this dude and it's another void. Oh no, I nearly died already. It's another void so I'm gonna try and get this over with first because I want to get all of them. Or try to. Alright, so I've got all the fire. What's this one? This is another one of the... Right, have I got this one? No, I haven't got this one either. Uh, I will get them eventually. And then I can come back. And I need to remember that I actually have a shield. I actually have a shield, so... You know, I need to remember to actually use that because it could help me from dying. Except when I do that. Uh. Thank you. I'll have that. Okay. So what's this one called? Path of Victory, two stars. Two stars feels more like five stars, but God knows what five stars will be like when I get to that. Uh, what the? Uh oh. <laughs> Path of Victory. It doesn't feel like it's going to be much of a victory. It's going to probably take me forever. Oh, that's a long drop. Uh, okay. Oh, so this is a thing that I can jump off? Oh god, alright. Anything down there? Yes, there is something down there, but I'll, uh, I'll get it in a minute. Oh god, I'm already like jumping forward to try and get to the edge. Why do I do that? What was the need? Why do I feel the need to do that? Oh, oh that's a bit of health lost. Uh, okay. No! <laughs> well, this is gonna take a long time. Okay. Oh, so close! Okay, okay. <laughs> I refuse to take as long as I did last time. Oh yes! Okay. Oh, I'm double jumping. All right. Hopefully, I haven't missed anything up there. I think I think I have. Crap. Um. Hopefully I can get to it later. Or I'll have to die. And uh, nah. Well, I had at least five goes then. Because I've got more health. So let's see if I can... Let's see if I can do it. Because I think it saves when you fail. <laughs> so I think it saves the amount you fail to get. Or not. No, yeah, I've got 17. Okay. So instead of going under, I'm just going to carry on... Oh, no! 
Stupid! I was wasn't paying attention to where I jumped. Uh Okay. Oh no, I did it again. Oh crap, yes, save! Alright. Okay. So now that I'm down here, I can hopefully get to where I was. Oh no. Okay, let's use some health. See if I can save myself the trauma of starting again. Right. Okay. Right, 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 right. Okay. Uh, is that a chest? Ooh. Okay, so I can't jump that way, so I'm gonna have to go down. Ooh. Ooh, chest. Didn't see that before. A void ore. I wonder what a void ore is for. Oh god, I don't like that. I don't like that I have to land on a fucking crystal. Okay. Oh, I see what I have to do. Oh, that's gonna be hard. Did I get that one? Yeah. Okay. Right. I don't think I got that one. No, I didn't. Right. So, um, one, two, three, five, six, I don't know how many I've got to get. Something like eight. Oh, no. Oh, oh, that was too close. I nearly died. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> I was so fucking close. Oh, man. That just makes my makes my heart sink. Right. No! Oh, my God. Fuck. No! Oh, yes! Yes! I managed. I managed. Okay. Oh. God. Alright. No. Am I got No. Uh, fuck! I only have to do one more! God! Why does this game torture you so much? Jesus! Oh, well. Mm. <laughs> well, I managed to survive, somehow. Thousands of tears later. Oh, that's just for the heart at the end of it. Like, why do they torture you so much just to give you the heart? They should give you more. This is unnecessarily hard, I think. Personally. Like, and I'm not just saying it because I keep dying, I'm saying it because it is actually hard and I'm not on a hard difficulty. I'm on the recommended difficulty which shouldn't be hard. <laughs> you know what, I'll just come back to you when I do it. It only get I think it only gives you the chance to double drop once as well. Which is fun. That I got now. Four, three, six, eight. 
God. Eight hearts, that's gearing me up for something, isn't it? Am I safe again? So I don't have to do all that again. I'm just doing it. I don't know if I have to, but I'm doing it so I don't have to do all that again. Right, spirits. Have I got any? I don't think I have. Okay, so now. Mana. Yep. Okay. Awesome. So I can do a thing, can't I? I can't remember the- Oh, there it is, yep. Fire! <laughs> I'm wasting my mana. Okay, and I just restored my mana. Awesome. Can't carry any more fire essence. I can see to that. I did kind of just waste that. I had, I had no reason for that. Uh, okay. Now can I go anywhere down here? No? Okay. See, this room was interesting to me anyway, so... Okay. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> He's flicking his hair. Spirit hunter. Well, well. What do we have here? You sound very confident. I'm gonna look around first before I talk to him. seen something like them. I've seen them twice. Ooh, chest. Okay. Sapphire ore. What do I do with all these freaking ore things? I, I can't get rid of them. Do I convert them somehow? I don't know. No, I can't read any either. Let's just talk to Mr. Confident here. Spirit Hunter or whatever he said his name was. Spirit Hunter Soul Tamer. Well, what do we have here? It is rare to find living beings these days. Aside from the shadow creatures, that is. They call themselves Spirit Hunter. You see, I have travelled this land for many centuries after the dawn of, sh of shadows. And during these travels, I have learned many arts. Over the years, I have mastered the art of hunting spirits. Listen closely, small one. How would you like to master the art of spirit hunting? Sure, why not? Yes! I felt the desire to possess other souls in you. How many young- ha now my young apprentice. I shall explain. Why do I feel I've just sold my soul to Palpatine? Spirit hunting is fairly easy. During your travels, you will come across spirits. Many survivors will also sell or give you spirits. They have found themselves. Each spirit has a special power. To activate that power, you must equip the spirits at any, at any fire shrine. Once you've collected a decent amount of spirits, return to me. I'll go and search for spirits. Make me proud. Okay. So I have to go and find spirits now. I think I've seen some odd ones floating about. But I haven't been able to get to them. There's one in this room like that I'm about to go into, but I don't know how to get to it. Hmm. Is a conundrum. No, I can't go that way. Oh. 
If I remember right, it's up there somewhere, but I, mm, I don't know how to get to it. So this is a fire shrine. Okay. Um, right, so I'm just going to go up the elevator again. See if I can somehow get to this bloody thing up here. Because there is one in here. I've seen it. I was, and there's one in the room when you first start the game, and I didn't know how to get to that either. Hmm. You see, it's over there. How do I get there? I doubt I can climb on this. Hmm. I mean, I can try and climb on it, but I think I will just fall. Tunnels cross. Oh, uh, I'll check that out in a sec. I mean, you're supposed to be able to wall climb in this, but I don't know how. Oh. I, uh... Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, God, that was lucky. I must be have to climb over it. Oh, God. Uh. Oh. Well, I'm on the statue. I don't think I'm supposed to be on the statue. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, that's not how you get over there. You know what, I'm just gonna go through here. <laughs> Sake. I nearly went then. to go down there? Probably not. You know you see a chest, you gotta go for the chest. It's just getting back now, that's gonna be fun. Oh, that was close, jeez. Oi. Right. Uh, sacrifices had to be made. It's a person. But I don't know if they're a good person or a bad person, so. 
overweight. And kill that first. Now I'm gonna beat some schools. That sounds weird. I don't know if they're an enemy or not. Unless that's the guy who was um, mad about elevators. That would make sense. Elevators are like one of my worst fears. Like, it actually. I hate them. I'm terrified of them. So. Oh, another chest. Probably with another ore. Yes. What the hell do I use these things for? Yeah, I'll go and talk to this dude now. Because, you know, he has to be here for a reason. Ooh. Entry protocol. This form is half filled. There is ink all over the sheet. Okay. I think he is the guy who was mad about elevators. I'm just getting everything I can. You know, I know it's annoying. But, you know, I want things. You made it! This is the Northwest Elevator. This beauty will take you to Stoneheart City. If only Umbert were here to admire this baby. Anyway, I can help you fix this elevator, but in exchange, pay me 2,400 all. After all, I am a master Orip. Would you like me to fix the elevator for you? Not yet. Quick, think of something or we'll scare him. Say. What if you were to pay me later, but twice the price, do you agree? No. Very well then. You won't find another way to the city. Good luck. I will get you your original price, you dick. But first, I've got to get back through all this horror. to get him or even though I've smashed it all up. Great. Um, so, where else do I go? Into that place? That's probably the best bet. How do you get... Okay. I'll have to figure it out. I think I've just left this area and gone on to a new one, which are... Mm. Right, what am I? Waterways. Right. Oh, is this another... Travel of the land, and blah 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 blah. Would you like to learn? Yeah, why well, not? Why not? Hat Kid Smug. What does that mean? I love it. I love the little dancers. I know for a f Ooh, didn't mean to do that. I know that I will be able to open places with the emotes and just finding the right ones. Um, activate? Can't activate. Why not? Okay. What the fuck do I have to do? <sighs> I'm not good at these type of games. I've played loads of them, but I'm not good at them. Oh, and all my oars came back now. Alright. And my enemies. That was satisfying.
actually feel tickly. Oh, oh. Let's see if this dick takes the, takes the same amount. Hi, is it nice to see you? Okay. Would you like to fix the elevator for- yes. Excellent, give me a minute. Okay. Perfect. The elevator is ready. Go ahead. Give it a go. Also, you have some extra time in Stoneheart. Feel free to pay me a visit there. Okay, so I'm going to the city. Great. I'm going there, Paul. So. Give me a sec. Isn't exactly fair though, is he? He might be an elevator enthusiast, but he's a dick. <laughs> you know, just a bit. Okay. Wait, what are all these? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully it won't fucking mess up on me again. Okay. I don't know if this is where I want to be, but... You know, I'll deal with it. Warning, elevators parking tunnels. Authorised tunnel personnel only. Does that mean me? Okay. Lights. Nice. Okay, so do I walk along the pipe? Alright. Oh yay, pipe work. Great. There's bits of ore along the pipes. I don't know whether I should go over there. Or try to go over there. Oh, she's Ripley! <laughs> Sorry about that. She scared me. Okay, let's see. I don't think I'd make that jump. Okay. This this is locked, so I can't go there yet. Open sesame. Right. I'm gonna go back over here if I can. Because I don't really wanna fall if I don't have to. Ladders. I don't know why that gives me comfort, but okay. So I have to navigate this place. Great. <laughs> it was a good thing I was still on the ladder. One of the annoying things about this is if you hit anything with ore in too close to a, a edge you lose it forever so no Let's just go back up. Nothing. I don't know what that noise is. Okay. Let's 
this. Okay. I think I've gonna got myself a bit stuck. Or not. There should be more checkpoints, there should be more saves. I think I've been playing for like two hours and done fuck all. I'm just going to go through here first. Ancient relic, an ancient royal scroll. Okay. Right, so I can't get down. At least I've got some more. I don't know what it said though, I missed what it said. Yeah. Wow. Stoneheart City. So this is the city? Oh, okay, I thought this was like a forest or something. Okay, so I need to get over there and save somehow, because I refuse to do all this shit again. So I have to get over there, so that was done. Hmm, okay. to intrude on your house, mister. Oh. Good evening, young one. I have been waiting for you. Oh. They refer to me as Ari the Crafter. Oh. But you may simply call me Ari. For centuries, my family have dedicated itself to the art of making tunics and swords. Oh. The needle of fate has spoken to me. Quite some time ago it foresaw our encounter. Mm. I don't quite know who you are, nor am I aware of your role in this land, or what's my part in your journey is. But it will oh, but it is the will of the needle that I assist you. Ah. However, how can I help you? Shop Right Aqua, light grey, purple, rainbow. Blue, violet, grey, green, yellow, yellow jacket, mm -mm. Uh, red. Um, I'll go for rainbow. Oh no, I like. Mm -hmm. No, not rainbow. No. 
That's too much like six. To, you know what, fuck it. <laughs> From now on, call me six. Let me know what you fancy. Uh, no. Very well. Maybe another time. May the queen be with you. I want to listen to a tale. Young swordsman. The story I will relay is the tale of the five temples. A long time ago, there were five gods. These gods gave birth to Penumbra. They created hope for the living. In return for such deed, the people of Penumbra built great temples to honour the gods. Five temples for five gods. A peace the gods embraced their temples, and the temples became their deathbed, where the gods were, rest, were to rest eternally. Thousands of years passed, and eventually, as the balance between light and shadow has always dictated, their rest was interrupted. Much worse than that, in fact. You see, before their eternal slumber, the gods had given birth to a queen. This powerful queen ruled the land. Blessed with the powers of the gods, she kept Penumbra safe and hidden. Hidden from the shadow. But the black shadow was ever persistent. It did rest, and eventually, it found the castle. The castle was soon overpowered, and the queen was possessed by the shadow. Driven by darkness, she called him most loyal lords. The lords responded to her call. Each of them were tasked to lead an attack, to enter one of the five temples and slay its god in its sleep. The people of Stoneheart prayed to the gods, but the gods never appeared. What was of them, no one knows. Swordsman, it was my task to tell you this tale. The needle is never wrong. However, it is up to you to discover why. May the queen be with you. Okay. That's an interesting story. So, where the swords? I want, I want to see swords. Okay. Well, thank you, Miss Master Ari. What's this one? It's another fucking thing. Ugh. Okay. Bye, Ari. Bye, old man Ari. So where do I go? Do I go down? I'm hoping so. Dude, let me save! Greetings, traveller. Yes! Oh no, I don't have enough ore! Because I bought this- oh. Great. What's this? A book set? Is this the old- Okay. So I've just found a set of books. I need a thousand! That's not an enemy. Oh shit, I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is someone else's house. I feel very cheeky walking into people's houses. Oh, no, to you. Ugh. What? Hey. That's my favourite ele elevated nautic. Elevator nautic. How did it go with the elevator? They really are awesome, don't you think? Oh, and by the way, I have something in my possession that may interest you. It is an odd stone. I really don't need this kind of stuff, but maybe you uh -huh. want it. It is said that the odd stone was stolen from one of the sanctuary angels in Penumbra. Amazing, right? Go ahead, take it. Uh, okay, you just give me a rock. Great. The old stone is yours now. I hope you like my gift to you. Friend. <laughs> I really have gave him a Palpatine voice without realising. <laughs> Friend. Something dark side. Right. So, okay. Let's go talk to the person I nearly killed. 
Oh, damn. Did I just kill myself? Nearly. Oh, you startled me! Wolfgang, flute player. Okay. Didn't you see I was practicing my music? Hmm. You aren't from here, are you? It's soothing to see your new survivors going around. Uh, you can call me Wolfgang. Uh, Ever since. So I've met Bit Oven and now Wolfgang. Okay. Ever since I came to the city, I cannot stop thinking about the city's uh, temple. Something about it calls in me. They say it was once the home of the god called Neros. Hey. I've met Neros. Do you think that's really true? I've... Oh. I'm not from these parts either. You see, I am from the Rust Village. Yeah. What? You have never heard of the Rust Village? Yeah. You are weird indeed. Now, wasn't Neros the one who was doing the experiments at the beginning where I woke up? Hmm. What does that mean? Can I go in here? No. Damn. Alright. No. I want to inspect. Another book set. Okay. I've done a lot of books here, dead and everywhere. I need. Oh! <laughs> Finding books everywhere. Oh my god, no, no, no! Oh, that was too close. Because I've only got like a slither of health. I'm being led somewhere. Okay, I've opened the temple. Saved. Why? <laughs> what was that? Uh, and I didn't get to save, so I'm gonna have to leave it all again. Beautiful, okay. Oh my god, I could cry. I could actually cry of pure joy. <laughs> ah, <laughs> that's, uh, I'm so happy about that. I did not know that that's where that opened to. Uh, you can, can you see the joy on my face? Oh my god. Right, I want to try and see if I can get my stuff back. I don't even know what it is. No, I'm not gonna get that back, so I've just lost. All of the ore. I'm 
just gonna have to find more. Forest trunk. Oh, okay, no, I don't wanna be here yet. That I need to find a way to save. Greetings, friend. My name is Mork. Are you from Ork? No one's gonna get that reference, except one person. I'm a librarian and merchant by blood. Descendant of ancient Morkos family. I collect books and objects and harness the knowledge within them. As a matter of fact, to celebrate our acquaintance, if you bring me five books, I will give you a valuable reward. Tell me now, are you interested in trading with me? Yeah. Uh, possessed book, golden lust, life steel, shiny leather pouch, a type of snow known for its medical properties, youthful ease, and types of all types of pain. Hmm. Well, I did have books. I may have got 11, so I'll give you 6. I can give you 3,000 for 6, is that it? Yeah! That's perfect, mate. That's all. Right. Hey. 97, so I'll give you about 20. Oh. Oh. Yeah, awesome. I did, I found books. Okay. I want the pouch. My ears at you. Three. Where's my tunic? Just call me six. I use them as well. Let's see if I can figure out how to give him the box now. Maybe I'm just not supposed to huh? do it that way. Oh. Oh. So I need to find more books. I can't find that order. Okay. So I have the ore I need to go and save now. I went the wrong way. As soon as I save, I'm turning it off. Because <laughs> I think I've done a fair bit now. I've made a bit of distance from where I was. I hope.
Let me save! Oh, good god. Save. Just making sure it's done. Wait, uh, I haven't got any spirits. I don't think. Okay. Good God. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this one here. Oh my God, that took forever to get here. The amount of editing is gonna be ridiculous. But okay, yes. God, all right. That took so long. I've been playing for nearly two hours and it took me forever just to get to some sort of progress. And I'm missing everything. I can't figure out how to wall run, so I'm gonna go and try and figure that out. Um, but yeah. This game is so complicated. It looks easy as hell when you look at it, but it's the, one of the most complicated games I've ever played in my life. Uh, it's amazing. I love this game, but oh my god. It's so hard. <laughs> uh, okay. Yes. So I couldn't I couldn't help but get the yellow tunic, sue me. <laughs> um but yeah. Ugh. I feel like I've been beaten up. I'm so tired from trying to get try, try not to die constantly. <laughs> um Yeah, okay. So this is part three of Blue Fire. And I got to I got I got all the way to the forest shrine and the city. Like I'm I'm going on to the forest shrine, but I got I got to the city. I got to I can't remember what it's called, but I'll figure I'll, I'll remember it in the editing. <sighs> okay, thanks a lot for bearing with me on this, guys. It means a lot. Um. Okay. See you later, guys.